thank you from China. We are coming back to Malaysia. I would like to invite Dr. Annie Mitin. She's the Vice President of the Malaysian Agroecological Society. She'll be talking about our initiative, Riza Beneh Community. Yeah? Uh, Community 6 Reserve Initiative. Okay. Annie, please. Yeah. Thank you, thank you, my guest. Hello, everyone. Selamat. Selamat tengah hari. Yeah, so I know this is close to lunch, so hang on. As you see already, all the beautiful, beautiful um, food resources that we have. I think this is so encouraging, and I learned a lot despite my coming late. So, but it's okay. So, what I'm gonna um, share uh, today is this initiative that we just started in Malaysia. Yeah, uh, because we see that there is a need for, for the community seed reserve to be um, strengthened. Yeah? Malaysia, our seed system, our farmer's seed system is definitely in, um, on track. There's a lot of threats to, to this system. I think your playing have shared yesterday during the forum. Yeah? Um, so hopefully that this initiative which started uh, during MCO, I guess 2021. <laughs> yeah, this so uh, is quite new. And when we see that you know during the crisis, um, a lot of us are not able to to access food. Yeah. So this is the the initiative Riza Pene Community or the Community Seeds Reserve Initiative. And this is you can see that we use the word reserve. Yeah, we don't use the word bank, yeah, and because we, at that point we also think, you know, do we use the word bank or do we use kalau bank bank ni? Then you know, so many, uh, you know, jin bank, all these uh, government places, uh, formal seed system, they use jin uh, jin bank, yeah, or seed bank. So we said we just use the word reserve. So from the name itself, we are we discuss quite a lot uh, in terms of what we call this. So I'm from uh, Sri Mas, uh, Agri College Society. And, um, okay, so let me, um, and this, um, this initiative, uh, we thought about it deeply, and we come up, this was during the International Seed um, Day in 2021. We come up with this logo, yeah. And we said, okay, and this is also um, collective effort yeah, that, to generate this logo. And we are so happy that everyone contributed and we said that seed is our heritage and let us sow and protect together. Yeah? In Malaysia, we know uh, from indigenous group, and I'm, I'm the Bidayu, I'm a Bidayu from Sarawak. And in our community, this is uh, common, yeah, that we save, seed, and share for the next uh, next sowing. And in my kampung, in my village, I can still get my traditional local variety of rice. Uh, my mother is still planting rice, yeah. So um, she plants four varieties of rice: the red, the kaladi. We also have our own sticky rice. Yeah, so this is why it's my passion is also into this. Yeah, so, um, and I'm so happy also to see that our champion, yeah, uh, champion that support this initiative, uh, we have Katya from Minkam has been very very supportive. Yeah, and Eddie is also you know going to various community to help with the uh, documenting a very seeds initiative here. Dr. Salma, of course, your play, and Amir is our our pusher. And Cap, Cap has been very, very strong uh, driver of this of this initiative. Thank you. So this initiative, you can see, is about promoting local agrobiodiversity conservation. At the moment, we stress on crops, yeah, tanaman. Uh, so this crop, we don't look at fish or livestock or this, this part yet. Uh, we just started. So we just get, want to get used to uh, putting the database together yeah? or inventory processes. Uh, it's quite new to a lot of people. And this initiative, why we want to promote local 
conservation through seed saving and sharing because we see that we have to overcome or go parallel in a way with what government are trying to do to snatch or hijack uh, our seed system. Yeah? So this was why we, we look at this. So first is to lo promote local agrobiodiversity conservation, seed saving through seed saving and sharing. And at the moment, this IRBK yeah, is um, we look at uh, creating web-based inventory. Yeah? So we want to build just information. Who has what? Where is this? Yeah? Um, just so that we can see that not just seed breeder have this uh, seed system. Yeah? We also will have it. Yeah? So this was the main thing. So it is a web-based database inventory by individuals or groups or community, CSO, uh, community-based organization. Yeah? So, this, so any enthusiast who like gardening, yeah? so if you have seeds you want to save, you want to share, we encourage that they register their, their seeds. And so this, and in terms of propagating, yeah, at the moment it is in situ. You do your own, uh, we, we don't have this uh, physical uh, seed reserve or collection. Yeah? This is in situ at individual site. Yeah? Uh, so for example, like uh, Mean House can have their own, uh, can have their own. Yeah? So this is because this is very costly, we know this. Yeah? So this is by uh, in-situ conservation, by individual group, community, CSO, and CBOs. And we see in Malaysia, a lot of, uh, on, there are so many these Facebook groups. Yeah? And these Facebook groups, there is Joe Conceivene, yeah? let's share seeds. It's already existing. Yeah? But the thing is, um, with this system, we, at the moment, it's difficult for us to tell whether it is local seed, whether it is heirloom seed, <laughs> whether it is hybrid, yeah, whether it is GMO. Yeah, even though we we know that in in Malaysia at the moment GMO, if you want to plant, you have it's not planted, but sometimes it can leak into the farming system. So this is why. At the moment, it is, uh, we just encourage the registration, but to test or to identify what it is, this is quite, uh, it, we are not there yet. Yeah? So this is uh, the first step for this. So the objective, um, and um, at the moment, we are also very grateful uh, that um, this initiative is also being funded uh, by the Agroecology Fund. The, to give us a, a push yeah, to, to look at this. And um, so why we do this, the first objective is we want to make our farmers' food uh, feed seed system visible and being recognized, especially by the government agencies. Yeah? So this is the first thing. Because it has been silent. Nobody, you know, they always think, Oh, formal and um, in our government side, there are two uh, two sides. One is the uh, plant breeders registration, yeah, and the other side is national list of uh, plant varieties, yeah. So the national list you can register whoever can register, and they're on the plant breeder side. This is typically for those who want to protect. These are really plant breeders under the our our law and the NP, the new plant variety protection act. So this is why we want to do this, is to increase awareness about the existence of legislation, treaties and trade agreement related to sea. A lot of us, the farmers especially, uh, even consumers, yeah, because when we buy sea, we do not know whether there is act, whether there is control yeah, um, that will uh, you know, affect our sharing yeah, and our eating actually. You know? I'm so happy to see you know, uh, with, the chi with the, uh, China and China, the farmers network, you have to address the market. Yeah? This is very, very important. 
the market you can see now with seeds, yeah, with the egg, uh, when it comes to buying seeds, buy seeds, you can buy on Shopee, right? You can buy on Lazada, right? Yeah, but what law, yeah, how is this affecting our conservation? I think this is very, very critical, yeah. So in that way, we would like that farmers to also understand, or all of us uh, in Malaysia, what are, is this rights to see? The ownership of seeds. There are two different things that we have to understand. Of course, you know, the third one is to increase to uh, the spirit of uh, practicing of saving. Yeah? Um, some of us take it for granted that we will save, and, but some, sometimes we don't share. We save for our own, and then at the end of the day, this seed will die off and will not be propagated. So that's why we also want to encourage this. Yeah? Collectively and collaboratively care. Yeah? Uh, because we cannot do, do this alone. Yeah? Seed conservation cannot be done alone. We have to collaborate. Networking is very important. Yeah? And this is again um, the, this aspect of uh, you know, um, monopoly. <laughs> yeah? Because ownership when it comes to seed, especially heirloom or traditional seed, everybody should share. This is our heritage. Yeah? If you want to claim your owners, the ownership on this, then you really have to compensate me, you know, really properly. Yeah? This is, uh, but we don't want to lose that, right? So, uh, of course, the stem is solidarity, yeah, and the fact that we are here, yeah is very much about this solidarity. And as I said, um, community-wise, we have to come together. Yeah? Thank you that we, we see this and care for organizing this. Yeah? So as I, uh, I think briefly, just to remind ourselves, um, these are important uh, in a track that we see that we must address. I think yesterday, this was also discussed, yeah, CPTPP and also the seed quality bill, uh, we, which we see at the moment our, really our biggest uh, trend. And in this way, uh, we see that if we have this IRBK, yeah, then we can say, look, our system, the pharmacy system is there, yeah, you, DOA or the, the government can have their two sides, <laughs> it's okay. But the community can share from here, provided that what we share is still within the scope of law. This is very important. Yeah, otherwise, IRBK also will, be get, will get sued. <laughs> so that is very important too. That's why our job is to understand where does your seed come from. Yeah. So farmers, before they, they put in, at the moment they probably do not know, but we will ask them to also think about where did you get the seed. If they say, oh, I get it from my neighbor, then right, this is from my Mr. X, my neighbor. <laughs> yeah? So traceability must still be there. Yeah? So this is how we want to also look at the trace. So um, we have the existing Biosafety Act um, and the uh, NPVP, and this is the one that is uh, getting uh, is worrying because this will be changed to this one. Biosafety Act related to GMO, and this is also being um, looked into a lot of. They are looking at amending a lot of uh, section, but I am so happy <laughs> in a way that uh, the Biosafety Act will include also social aspect, socio-economic aspect. So a lot of cultural dimension will be included, hopefully, in this change. Yeah? So uh, that is a, promise, <laughs> a promising future, at least for, for us. Yeah? And then um, this ABS, access, this is also something that we have to worry about, uh, because if CP, CPTPP uh, take off, then most probably, they will also look at this. They will disturb this. Because there is a special clause to say that this act can be revised according to 
the situation of any agreement that is being signed by the government. So, trade agreement can take priority over this what is existing. Yeah. So this is something that we are, uh, you know, concerned about. So, just briefly, this is the, the face of our website. Yeah, uh, Amir has put a lot of work into this. Encik um, Yusaimi is not here. Is Yusaimi here? No. And um, so, uh, we call it IRBK. You can see uh, nice uh, seeds uh, blooming coming out. Yeah, this, uh, and um, so, it, there's a bit about us. Uh, a bit on um, seeds, uh, you know, guideline. Yeah? It is under development, it's not fully developed yet. Uh, still, a lot of section are uh, uh, waiting for content. Yeah? Uh, we, we don't have full time content manager at the moment. Yeah? And uh, we hope to, to enable this soon. And uh, there's also um, references, source of references. Uh, farmer story, yeah. This we need to build. Farmer story, why they keep seed like you know the example earlier is so nice to see, and we still do not have this yet. I hope to that this initiative will lead us towards that. Eddie, get inspired now, yeah. <laughs> yes, yeah. So we get, we hopefully we we will get there, and, you know, uh, to see what being done. Yeah, and then uh, we also look at uh, you know invite invite um, seed savers to join us. Yeah, this is very important. Uh, but the reach, the outreach is still very limited. Yeah, uh, we need to still look at how do we promote uh, this uh, this initiative. Yeah, first is awareness. At least my fellow Malaysian here will also be our champion and lead the way. Yeah. So, yes, and um, and here, you know, um, it's a nice feature that Amir also included um, to see how many um, seeds are in the inventory. And at the moment, uh, we we definitely we do not disclose uh, who is um, having the seed. But if you like to have, then you can contact us, and we will also connect you to the seed singer. So on this one, we, uh, this was uh, I captured this morning. So at the moment, two six four, not bad. Yeah, uh, uh, seeds that we have. Yeah, um, but it's not fully processed yet. Um, there's a lot of processing involved. Yeah. Okay, and these are the the organization at the moment who are behind this initiative. Um, the, um, so it is you can see. Um, that's it. We have simple terms of reference. Yeah, uh, the organization can be uh, with us uh, just by signing whether how you want to contribute, whether on uh, technical or financial or in you know, a human resource. This is up to you. But we would like to invite as many many um, civil society, even villagers, yeah, kampung to be part of this. Yeah, the more the merrier, and we can really show that. We are united as Malaysia in this approach. I think this is very, very important. So we have uh, this is uh, FKM logo, Srimas, uh, Pesawa, and uh, Grass. Uh, Amir is representing, uh, of course, Yokwin is here for TWM, yeah, uh, Sam, Gabungan, uh, this GDI. So we have this, we hope to expand. Misa can join, yes? Uh, <laughs> Yeah. Okay. So this, uh, so we have our registration is on app. This app on job form. We use job form. We did not use Google. <laughs> Google form. Why? Because some of our members, they they boycott Google. Yeah. <laughs> See. <laughs> So that's why we find a different platform. So you know, being being in NGO, sometimes you have certain things that support. So you know, so so we do this on job form. So there is an app, 
and we really hope that this app also will try to improve uh, from time to time yeah, uh, to see whether it, uh, if there's any problem with the, the, the instrument. So, and you can see it, this picture is from CAM. Thank you, CAM, for allowing us to uh, use, and you have the book also on this now. So, simple thing, we have a uh, local name, yeah, uh, we try to make it simple, yeah. So, uh, local name, and uh, local name can be in, you know, in, in your language, yeah. You, can, you call it, uh, you know, just use your own local language, yeah. If you can describe a bit, it will be good. Because part of this initiative is also in terms of conserving biodiversity based on culture and languages to describe the same crop. Yeah? I'm with the, also with the Technical Committee uh, Malaysian Standard for Fresh Veggie, Fresh uh, Fruits. Yeah? And for example, if we look at capsicum, yeah, um, in some place uh, we call it um, cheap manis. Yeah? In, so we also record, put that on the standard, also known as chili manis or chili bangla. Yeah, so this is also part of it. So we, we want you to conserve that. The science one, the botany, if you know, you put. If you don't know, it's okay. Yeah? And then there's also the variety that if you know it, you uh, put it in. If not, it's also okay. And then what is the use of this is very important. And then, the, um, and then what, would, what is special about this? Yeah? What is special about this crop? Why do you keep it? Yeah? So this is very important. When, when did you produce this one? And how is this being uh, preserved? Whether as seedling, as seed, as cutting, rhizome, spore, in what form is it kept? Yeah? And then the quantity that you uh, keep and also what is your purpose? Is it uh, just uh, for sale, or is it to share, or is it for own use? Yeah, I think quite um, quite simple. So, for example, this is uh, from Kaya, <laughs> yeah, uh, from in-house care. Very simple. Then we see kasum, yeah, ulam, yeah. So, and at the moment, uh, actually on the form, we have about three hundred and five responses. And you can see every mulberry, bendy, what they call, we will have this. This is uh, generated by John Ford. So, and this is example, yeah, uh, from one place or uh, one crop, maybe some keep as anak coco or uh, the seedling, some as rhizome, yeah, so we have this breakdown. I'm going to go a bit faster because people are so, uh, so, with the, so this is what we have at the moment yeah, uh, in our database. And why do they keep? We can see uh, about 30%, 39% is for own use. Yeah? For Kongsi at the moment, not many. Yeah? And some also for sale, 175. Yeah? And so this, this we have, and also it's sharing this year. The this is uh, this is wrong registration. So. Yeah. And we also identify in Malaysia where are this location. Yeah, the, at the moment Kelantan Kelantan ni, wow Kelantan ni, okay, yes, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Kelantan is really Sabah, Pakos, Maulegi, yeah, Pakos Sarawak belum ada. Sarawak not here yet, so we want to see Sarawak. So we want to see more states going uh, involved in this. Yeah. So uh, this is uh, just yeah. So this is uh, my presentation at the moment. Yeah, and we hope that uh, we can work together to improve this. Uh, uh, well, to really uh, push this. You know, help us uh, uh, share the website. I can. Uh, we will share with you the link so you can just viral it. It's okay to viral this. Yeah. So that is the way we will move forward. So thank you very much for your attention and help IRBK. Thank you.